Namaste. Hello everyone and warm welcome to this session. I am invited to speak and share about nature and especially the fire element and how the fire element can help us to achieve great health so before I go into techniques and mantras and meditation I'm going to brief a little bit about the elements and how the elements are connecting the universe the earth and us together so as you all know as within as without so there are constellations in the universe there are five elements it's the earth element the water element the fire element the air element and the space element all those elements are connecting us and they are connected through electricity so in the universe we have the five elements and those five elements are also on our earth and those five elements are also in us human beings the question may arise are those five elements in the animals and in the plant kingdom yes they are but not as many if you go to the mammals they have only four elements and when you go to the birds they have only three elements and when you go to the reptiles they have two elements and when you go to the plant kingdom there is the water element so the human being is the most evolved creature living on this planet so many people have spoke about different things and topics around the nature in this event and I'm going to spoke speak about the nature within what is our true nature and how can we connect with the fire element within us and how can we evolve our own fire element to bring up our consciousness our energy and gain perfect health it is like this my folk when the fire element is fully developed and we have a lot of energy in our fire element the water element and the earth element are automatically becoming active and starts to work properly so when the fire element is totally developed we will gain total health why is it important to have the fire element developed and why is it important to have all elements developed because we want to function properly right then the earth has to be in balance the water has to be in balance the fire has to be in balance the air has to be in balance and the space the akash also has to be in balance so many people may struggle with money struggle with job struggle with finding food that is because the earth element is not balanced some people may struggle with health that is because the fire element is not working properly so everything is connected to the elements 
and we can do certain exercises meditation and mantra to develop all our elements so we can come in contact with our true nature which is something within so when we do proper meditation when we do meditation every day we connect we're working with connect with something within right we close our eyes and when you close your eyes you notice there is darkness there right mm -hmm. so what is it that makes you experience that darkness because there gotta be something beyond right that makes you experience the darkness even when you close your eyes contemplate on that what is it that makes you experience darkness when you close your eyes so now we are coming closer to our true nature because our true nature is beyond this physical body it's beyond mind it's beyond emotions it's beyond every every idea you have about yourself if you let go of all those there is a possibility that the true nature will arise within you so we close our eyes again and we come in contact with our breathing so we breathe in and we breathe out so when we breathe in we are coming in contact with life life is breath when you were born you started to breathe when you leave this physical body the breathing stops isn't it so so life is breath so when we are coming in contact with the breath we are coming in contact with life we are coming in contact with nature experience when you go out in nature when you work in nature when you hug a tree when you walk barefoot on the beach or in the wood what happens with the mind the mind slows down right because you are coming in contact with nature with life life outside connects you to life inside so the breath slows down unless you are running around on the beach or in the woods the breath will be very very calm right because the mind becomes calm because you come in contact with nature so many people go out in nature when they want to find peace because no one is judging you when you go around in the in the nature right there's only us human being we judge each other oh look at him look at her and we get ideas and we start to judge but when we are in the nature no one is judging us we are truly in contact with the nature and that helps us to come in contact with ourselves but if we don't have the possibility to be in nature what can we do then we can do meditation because meditation can help you to come in contact with your breath with life and inside of the breath you have the life force energy which is the prana the pranic energy which moves in when you breathe in the pranic energy comes in spreads out to the chakras to the blood to the cells to the body and to the elements 
so we have the physical body right then we have something called the astral body then we have something called the casual body there are three types of body we took it at 35 elements constellations so in the physical body we have 16 in the astral body we have 19 and in the astral body there are the five elements the earth the water the fire the air and the akash the space are all in the astral body so when we do purification when we work with the with the fire element we are working and purifying our consciousness so when the consciousness gets purified in this part in the navel or in the astral navel we are actually working in the astral body so we are working with the elements we are working with the earth with the water the fire the air and the space those five elements have different actions you can see you can hear smell touch taste and they have different actions in form of we can walk we excrete there is metabolism there is digestion and just the digestion is the part which is in contact with the fire so if you have a properly working digestion machine you will process the food very well okay when this nostril the right nostril is active the fire element is active in your system so when you are sitting and you are ready eat your food breathe in slowly through your nose and experience which nostril is more active and if you experience hunger during the day take a closer look what nostril is more active so when this nostril is more active the right nostril is more active your fire machine is on that means if you eat when this nostril is active the digestive system will work better some of you may have difficulties in your stomach area difficulties with anxiety worries and you have a very bad health that is because of imbalances in the fire element so what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you an exercise there are many exercises to do but this is one and this is called Agni Sara Agni Sara is an exercise which will help you to develop the fire element so you can have a better digestion and you can provide for yourself every day so you can fill up more energy in your system so to say because when we're working with this exercise you move more prana into your system into your body your astral body your casual body into the nervous system so you automatically become more healthy because the prana will move out from the oxygen and spiritualize itself and then it moves and it gives you loads of energy because when we go into certain things in life there may be mental problem physical problem or emotional problems then we lose a lot a lot a lot a lot of energy we may not be able to think we may be so in our emotions that we just acting we say bad things we do bad things based on our emotions we lose something and we are down 
you know things are happening with the emotional imbalances so when we do this exercise on a daily basis you can build up yourself so when those things comes to you in life you're able to handle them you're able to handle them without going totally in and be dragged down in it and lose energy many of your people are very sensitive these days we are very very sensitive to energies to places to other people you know we're empaths we feel a lot right some of us may be healers or we may work in the spiritual realm of helping people then it's very very important to build up this energy to build up this fire energy so you don't lose energy when you help others okay so this is a very good exercise for everyone to do what is important is you need to do this on an empty stomach I eat it food for around two and a half hours ago so it's not the best thing for me to do it but I will do it carefully just to show you how it's done I recommend you wait at least three and a half hours before you do this exercise do it on an empty stomach is the best thing so what we do is uh, we breathe out we breathe out energy and we do like this so the energy is out and the next step so this will be three steps we breathe out the energy step number two is to pull the stomach in you create like a vacuum with your stomach so the stomach goes in and then you start to move the stomach in and out you pump the stomach in and out okay so I will now show you so you can do it properly by yourself so we breathe out and we create a vacuum And the stomach goes in and out and you do this exercise in the set of three so you do it one two three four five as a start and you relax 30 seconds to one minute and then you do it again one two three four five you relax for 30 seconds to one minute and you do it again one two three four five and relax if you do this exercise every day you will see a great change in your energy and your energy level because we need to know how we can raise our energy level and this is a great exercise to do that so my highest recommendation is that we do this exercise every day it is one of the exercises that helped me to go from being suicidal depressed to gain my energy back and now have extreme amount of energy on a daily basis so I have experienced it myself from being on the bottom bottom low of your own energy and now how to know how to raise my energy whenever I want so it's my highest recommendation that you do it on a daily basis if you have any questions about it you can just ask me and I will I will help you further with it so now I want to share a meditation with you. A meditation to help you build up the fire element you have within. So you can have a strong fire element. 
so the file man can develop itself so you can become total healthy so you can have a good digestion machine and if you do this meditation that I show you together with exercise you will have great great benefits on a daily basis so I want you to close your eyes And I want you to have all your attention at the navel. Put all your attention at the navel center. I will do this together with mantras and a special infrared light to help you expand in your fire limit. As you may know, the infrared light is a special technology you use the remote on your television, on the car, you use it in the saunas for different health benefits. And now I'll give you, I'm going to send out through me the infrared light as spiritual energy. Put all your attention at the navel. Now experience how the energy start to move clockwise in your navel and now there is an infrared light coming into that circle of light which is moving clockwise in your navel center and just visualize and feel how the energy is moving clockwise in your navel center Chanta Mantra, which will deepening the process. Om Bo Bhuvasvaha Tat Sat Vitur Varenyam Vargo Divasyadi Mahi Dio Yona Prachodaya Om Bur Bhuvasvaha Tat Sat Vitur Varenyam Bargo Divasya Dimahi Dio Yona Prachodaya Om Vasvaha Tat Sat Vitur Varenyam Vargo Di Vasya Di Mahi Di Oyona Prachodaya Now, just feel that this infrared light is moving from the navel 
and into your spine and up to your spine into your brain in the nervous system into every cell into the blood and into the DNA so as this energy moves everything becomes infrared your body becomes infrared your brain becomes infrared the spine is infrared Om Bhur Bhuvasvaha Tat Sat Vitur Varenyam Bhargo Mahi Yoyona Prachodaya Om Bhur Bhuvasvaha Tat Sat Vitur Varenyam Vargo Divasya Dimahi Viyoyona Prachodaya Your whole body is infrared Everything is infrared. The infrared light is now healing you. It's helping you activating the fire element. So you can have super conscious and super health. Now I suggest you to lay down so you can continue to receive this energy Feel the energy in your third eye. And feel the energy in your navel. And feel how the energy moves from the navel up to your third eye. And down through the spine. Everything becomes clean everything becomes purified you can do this meditation whenever you want to get it with the exercise I showed you to help you build up the fire element to help you purify all your elements in the astral body to help you gain more energy to help you gain better health to help you raise your energy level whenever you want to Thank you for tuning in. Om Namah Shivaya. Namaste.